again, that story we were telling you about a disabled child who is not allowed to have his cannabis medication at school now has a state legislator seeking to change a law. Jack split using that cannabis patch and oil, but Jeffco says he can't have them on campus. Only on 7 News, once again, let's get back to Lindsay Watts to find out about plans to expand access for kids like Jack. Teresa, it is Longmont Democrat Jonathan Singer who says that he is going to be proposing this legislation that will let kids take cannabis medication at school, something that schools right now do not allow. It's not easy. It's worth it because look at that face. It's taken Stacy Lynn nearly 14 years to find the best way to treat her son's spastic cerebral palsy. Right now you see he's pretty calm. This is the cannabis oil. It's making him able to relax his hands and pay attention. She says drops of cannabis oil and a patch on his wrist. Zero psychoactive properties. Have done wonders for Jack. But when his school found out that's what his private nurse was giving him, it said no more. Imagine your, your muscles contracting as hard as they can, turning your joints in the opposite direction. It hurts. She says learning has become painful. He cries. Shh, I'm sorry, I told. <laughs> it, it makes it's very embarrassing for him at school. He's 14. He's in eighth grade. He has a lot of peers. He has a lot of friends. It's embarrassing for his body to take over. Our first story about Jack caught the attention of Representative Jonathan Singer. And really bringing this issue to light. At the Capitol in coming weeks, he'll propose regulating cannabis the same way as other serious drugs kids take before class. If we can do this for heavy narcotic medication, we can certainly do it for medical marijuana, especially the medical marijuana that doesn't have that same intoxicating element of, of THC in it. This used to be easier. <laughs> and now he's a huge boy. Lynn says help from lawmakers will go a long way to ease fears about medical marijuana at Colorado schools. This is not Cheech and Chong. This is not, you know, reefer madness. Anybody. This face, this one here, <laughs> is the face of medical cannabis. And all the school districts we contacted say they do not allow any type of cannabis on campus. It's not just Jeffco. The principal at Jack's school says he wants to help Jack every way possible, but does not want to break any current laws. Lindsay Watt, 7 News.